And with the word in the upper room, the shadows lengthen. Hymn 202. On this night, more than any other night, we trust the love that comes to us in Jesus Christ, promising us forgiveness, forgiveness that changes our life because it is complete. We trust that forgiveness we see in the cross as we gather our hearts together to pray the prayer of confession. Let us join our hearts in prayer God of this day, forgive my pretense that I know when I do not, that I care when I am callous, that I see when far too often I cover my eyes, turn my head, walk away. God of this moment, transform my shortcomings that I can be trusted when I sometimes betray, that I can believe when I often deny that I can hope when deep within I bargain with hopelessness. Renew me, O God, by your far-reaching grace. Restore me, O God, to your life-giving truth that the kingdom, power, and glory are yours at this moment, on this day, for all time. Amen. In Romans 8, we hear Paul asking, who shall condemn us and separate us from the love of Christ? And he answers, only Christ. And Christ lived for us. Christ died for us. Christ rose in power for us. Christ reigns in heaven for us. If we are in Christ, we are a new creation. And the old way of living is gone and the new way of living is here. Friends, believe the good news of the gospel that we see especially this night in Jesus Christ. We are forgiven. Amen and amen.